morning, it's the 16th of September 2024. Oh, is it cold, Dave? Yeah, it's a bit, bit nippy, bit nippy. It's going to be a nice day, though, looking at the sun setting again out. Uh, got Dodgy Dave on the bird this morning. Today we're going to talk about Sir Keir Starmer. I said. <laughs> Keir Starmer, yes, but before that, Dave. Uh, Hugh Edwards, he's that BBC news reader. He's uh, he's in court in Westminster today at Magistrates Court. Uh, he's going to get a sentence for having indecent images of children on his phone, or he's going to be uh, referred to Crown Court. I should think it'd be a Crown Court job if they're being serious, which is a serious offence. Overnight, Dave, I don't know if you know, but Donald Trump, he survived another... Oh, uh, a, a load of bollocks. Exactly. Uh, thank you, Dave. Another assassination that attempt. Were a load of bollocks, I was just going to say, Dave, I wonder how many can cram in before election, how many suicide. Yeah. Thank you, Dave, for you put me in. And bad news for us, Dave, at our age, uh, the government are going to rush, rush through uh, an assisted dying bill. Uh, I'll try and say that without whistling on the ass. Uh, assisted dying bill, yeah. So... Uh, not only are they taking us winter fuel allowance off, they're going to kill us, help, to help us to die. But to be fair, they've been doing that for 50 years. Look how many they helped up chimney on uh, in pandemic. They didn't just die, they're 100, 200,000 people who were helped on the way. You know what I mean? Went down to the lamp, morphine. <laughs> Come and get it. So, again, back to Sakia Storm with Dave. You were at St. Ledger Saturday. Sakia were there, did you see him? No. Oh, he got a bit of a. Bit of a reception, I'm going to show you this clip. He got booed and he got, well, I'll show you what happened. <laughs> Boo! Wanker! Wanker! <laughs> Blow a shot. I mean, it's not very good when, uh, like, Doncaster is a Labour Auckland, as you know, Dave, and it's not very good when uh, Labour supporters are booing him. Uh, it did come out, though, that weekend that he's. Uh, some Labour donors bought his wife 79,000 quid worth of clothes. 79,000 pounds and he's forgot to declare it. And people are going mad. They're going to go even madder when they find out about Michelle Moan and, uh, and died of hard in fucking Jesus, man. But what I'm trying to say to people here, and I've been saying it's a millionaires club, it's a multi millionaires club, but let's, let's call it what it is. It's not a millionaires, it's a multi millionaires. Every one of them 650 MPs who was in Parliament should get fucking a reception like Sir, Sir Keir Starmer got, wherever they go. I think Alex Webb, uh, she got boated out of Boza down uh, in all the show a week and they, boat, they fucked her off all local, don't want you in this pub. She's a, she's a Labour MP for, for all the show to do, believe. But what they're doing, <laughs> they're playing a very dangerous game. They're getting the public's back up there. The, 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 what they're doing, they're funny segregating various sections of society. Uh, for their own failings, so they're blaming immigrants, they're blaming sick, disabled, unemployed, pensioners, they even blame it fucking train drivers. The doctors are saying that the labour will give the train drivers the pensioners money. What a lot of bollocks are the doctors. And uh, and they're blaming all them, the demonising all them minority groups for the cost of living, high cost of living. And the high cost of living is down to greed, it's down to MPs and greed. The MPs have allowed companies to rip us off. MPs of all parties, I'm saying. And uh, it's time fucking people got angry. And I don't mean by launching personal tax on MPs. Get angry with the fucking old government. The old system, it's corrupt. The fucking having us pants down. And I'm going to leave you with a little quote, and it's a one-line quote from Stephen Kinnock, SMP, and he says, The more things change, the more they stay the same. Wake away. Wait, give me a...